Welcome to the Mechanic Desk Help Videos. In this tutorial, we look at two features associated with stock items, pricing levels and sales and purchase history. To see the pricing levels for a stock item, click on the Inventory tab and select a stock item from the list. In our sample item, three pricing levels have been set, with and without GST. To set a pricing level for a particular customer, click on the Customers and Vehicles tab, select a customer from the list, and click in the Customer Details section to expand it. Click on the Price Level pop-up menu and select the desired value. Click on Save. Create a new invoice by clicking on the New Invoice button. Enter vehicle details and click on the Continue button to bring up a new invoice. In the Description section, click the Add Item link and enter the stock item into the field. The price automatically reflects the level set for that customer, in this case Level 2, but can be overridden manually by clicking on the Prices pop-up menu and selecting another value. Click on Finalize to complete the process. To see the sales history of the stock item, click on the Inventory tab, select the stock item from the list, and the Sales History section displays the relevant details for each sale. To track the purchase of a stock item, click on the Invoices and Bills button, then select the Bills tab. Enter the relevant details and click Continue to generate a form. Enter the name and quantity and click on Save to complete the process. To see the purchase history of the stock item, click on the Inventory tab, select the stock item from the list, and the Purchase History section displays the relevant details for each purchase.